Before we start the video today, something that's absolutely amazing you should know, and that is that Mercedes-Benz will finance not only the van, but the entire upfit. So give me a call, 623-815-3995, Lane Rogers, Mercedes-Benz of Arrowhead. Thank you. Hi there, Lane Rogers at Mercedes-Benz of Arrowhead Sprinter Department. I, uh, I'm coming to you today. It's a very special day here at Mercedes-Benz of Arrowhead because we have the all new 2023 all wheel drive Sprinter. Now notice I said all-wheel drive, not 4x4, because Mercedes-Benz has changed to a permanent all-wheel drive system. We have this beautiful vehicle here uh, upfitted, so come on in and I'll show you what we've done. So one of the things that we've done this new for 2023, as you can see, this grill guard is a little different. It's actually Alvan's new grill guard. So you've got a receptacle here if you wanted to put a winch inside. Of course, the tow receptor is in a front hitch. So you also notice that we have a lot more space here. Uh, obviously, 4x4 had a little bit. The all-wheel drive has a little bit more. We have these beautiful Terra wheels, again, from Alvance. One thing that we decided to do on this, very important, is put the BF Goodrich tires on it. Why is that? Well, they're not that much more, and they provide an amazing highway and off-road ride. So a lot of my clients ask, Lane, I want the V6 diesel. They've had that engine for 35 years and it's amazing, it's bulletproof, et cetera, et cetera. And I get that. However, they've had the four cylinder diesel for almost a hundred years and they were able to get 211 horsepower out of it and 332 foot pounds of torque. That's better than the V6 gave us. And guess what? It's smoother. So I wanted to bring you inside the engine compartment for another reason besides the beautiful four cylinder that we have here. And that is, if you looked at last year's V6, obviously a bigger engine block, but we didn't have all this room in here. A lot of people like to put their battery up front, uh, save a little space. I recommend inside because of heat, but you'll notice that all this is uh, open. Why is that? Well, there's no power steering pump. There's no power steering fluid. There's no power steering assembly. It's now all electric. So electric steering, less weight, more accurate, easier to drive, and there's a whole lot more. Let's go inside. Before we go inside, there's a couple things I wanted to touch base on back here. Obviously, we've got our beautiful owl boxes, lockable, waterproof, airtight, love them. We've also got a factory hitch. Factory hitch is gonna give us 5,000 pounds of towing capability, and then we've got our get up to the top ladder. So let's go inside the back real quick and we'll see what beautiful things we have to offer back here. First off, you'll notice how beautiful the knotty pine is. It's all wood. We're still allergic to sawdust and glue and formica and laminate and all that. So very, very nice, real smelling, delightful wood. You've also got your water containment filler here. We wouldn't forget about the shower here, hot and cold. We've also got a 25 gallon tank back here and immediate heated water. So that's all provided by interior battery package. What kind of battery package you ask? Well, we've got these amazing Battleborne lithium batteries. Not one, not two, not three, but four. People ask why do you need four Battleborne lithium batteries. The answer is you could literally go off grid for about a week and a half and never run out of power. So the wood obviously still continues. You can see how beautiful the interior is here. One thing that we did not forget is food storage. Uh, we have the 
Dometic CFX 35. In here, you've got a freezer section and a cooler section, which is really cold right now. The thing that we like about this cooler system is that we've actually hardwired this in, but you could remove it, take it out of the van. It'll run on its own power for a while. You can also stop it there. It's got this beautiful hinge system here. It also acts as a USB power source. So if you were out in the middle of nowhere, wanted to power up your phone or other device, you could do that from the cooler itself. So the thing that we hear from our clients most off is storage, storage, storage. And I agree, in a 144 Sprinter van, it's a ton of room. However, it's the fishbowl effect. You will fill every nook and cranny up. So storage is definitely an important thing. We've got great storage down here. We've got a removable table for lunch, swivel seats, storage here as well. And one of my favorite, the new closet system. So we can remove this bar and make it all storage or actually hang clothes. Storage, storage, and storage. So the other great thing is food. We love food when we're on the road, when we're here even. Uh, we have the induction stove right here. The cool thing about this system is that everything can be on a timer. So let's say that you catch a fish, run out, forget about what's here. It'll actually turn itself off. Hot and cold running water here. Gray tank below. Beautifully styled fixtures. And your control panel up here. So, I love this because it's simple, effective, wonderful. I can turn all these systems on or off. I've got tons of extra power ports here. This is all 2.5 volt, or five volt rather, uh, power. You've got three of those. And there's our inverter status, 98%. And this van has been running. I mean, we, we've taken it down for another video. We've run it, the cooler's on, and we're still at 98% and we're inside. You've also got real plugs here, which we like. And then of course your lighting controls here. So comfort, very important. Not only do we have this four inch comfortable soft foam mattress here, your air conditioner is right up here. So why is that? Well, if it ever gets hot, you blow it directly down on yourself. It is a 12 volt air conditioner from Dometic. Uh, it is about 13,000 BTUs of icy cold niceness when you're out and about. So we never recommend cooking in the van unless you have proper ad, uh, ventilation. So we put in a max air van fan here with rain sensing closure. If it rains, it'll automatically close itself. One thing that we did differently this go round is put in these large, beautiful windows. Why? Well, the other windows we see are a little bit smaller and we want ventilation. We want to see out Obviously, they're tinted and we have custom shades for them coming, but we love that we can get that crosswind. The door has it as well, so you've got a really good cross breeze if you need it. So the basis of any van, before we convert it, we want to have our creature comfort, starting with, obviously, power windows, power mirrors that fold in. Safety features are very important, so you've got the blind spot monitoring, automatic lights, you've got the shift up and down. So I promised something special that's new this year, and that is we now have a nine speed transmission. So if you think about it, you pair up that beautiful four cylinder diesel with all that horsepower and all that torque to a nine speed transmission that I can actually control manually if I want to, or just let it drive. And that's a recipe for a very quick, efficient van, not to mention the gas mileage combined with that engine and that transmission. Very exciting. One thing I'm very proud of, and, and it may be just a Sprinter thing, but I love the fact that we have wireless Apple CarPlay. Some of our cars don't even have that yet. The Sprinter has it, which I love. So I can hop in my vehicle and automatically I have my CarPlay ready to go. One other thing that's very important in my opinion, especially when you're in a van like this, maybe you, you're a first time van owner, uh, and that is 360 camera. So this vehicle has it. You can see back, forward, side, front, and panoramic front. Trailer view, which is important, obviously. So that, to me, is a, is a big must-have when you're talking about a van. Uh, touch screen here, have to control if I want, so I don't get uh, 
get this all cloudy with fingerprints. Uh, safety systems, huge, huge, huge. Active brake assist, attention assist, that's a big one. And you can control and set all these things up. Turn them on or off if you want very easily. Uh, it also has voice commands so I can say, hey Mercedes, take me to Costco. Off I go, that easy. You also have Wi-Fi built into the system, which we love. The new glove compartments with charging up front here, a big plus. And not to forget, 10 cup holders up here. You've also got airbag galore, front, front, knee, knee, side curtain, thorax airbags. One of the safest vehicles you can buy, period. So, once again, we have used these absolutely gorgeous OWL side steps. Why OWL? Why these side steps? Well, they look good. They're incredibly useful. They don't stick out to the point where I'm going to hit the back of my legs on them. We must also remember uh, the foot scrape. That's important. Love, love, love these things. This is different as well, you'll notice. This flare is actually a flare space flare. It bows out. We decided to keep it the uh, black because it fits in well with the design. It actually has a presence to it. Let us not forget the beautiful Fiamma 45S. Why Fiamma? They are the best awning you can buy, period, in the United States. They come out of Florida. They're actually hurricane proof. Wonderful, wonderful awning. One thing that's very important that we can't see, but it's up there. Uh, I go to as many van shows, expos as I can. Uh, last year in Big Bear, California, I saw the most amazing thing. It is a flexible solar panel. Why is that unique? Well, on one simple solar panel, I'm getting 190 watts, which is double, almost double, what an old panel was. It's flexible, I can touch it end to end, and I can walk on it. And it's got a 25-year warranty. So instead of losing all that space to solar panels, hard panels that can break, get damaged, get, get gunk on them, I'm now able to use the entire deck of my upfitted Sprinter. So that I love. Uh, again, thank you. I appreciate your time. Thank you for all the hits on the, the last videos. And if you have any questions, please call Lane Rogers at Mercedes-Benz of Arrowhead. My direct line, 623-815-3995. If you have any questions, if you need any referrals on some of these things, we are an authorized dealer for Al, Al uh, equipment. They're wonderful. They're located here. Dometic as well, uh, and Nomadic Air Conditioning, and Tommy Vance, who did this beautiful outfit for us. So once again, thank you. Have a great day.